Hey y'all, it's me, Blessed Bro. I am here with my weekly update. Gonna give you a recap of my previous week. So today is actually Tuesday when I'm recording this video and I'm gonna record it and gonna go ahead and upload it now because I'll be posting on Tuesday. And I'll, Lord will, and I'll keep posting on Tuesday. However, I did not weigh myself on Monday, which was yesterday. I have a lot going on. I actually forgot to weigh myself Monday morning. My oldest granddaughter is in the hospital. She's been there since Saturday. So my because my granddaughter is in the hospital, we had to make uh, alterations to our schedules. Uh, my husband and I, because my husband, my daughter and I, we have, uh, you know, my family, my daughter has her family, and then we are over here helping my brother with his family, my six nieces and nephews who uh, recently lost their sibling and their mother in October. So we all pull together to help them out. Well, my daughter, her daughter is in the hospital, so she's been staying over there. So I had to make a few alterations, and we we take them all to school. With All of them are car riders, so we usually... The three of my my husband takes some, I take some, and my daughter takes some. So my daughter stayed at the hospital, which is like oh, about 30, at least 30 minutes away from here. I was going to say 30 miles, but it's at least 30 minutes from here. And so she is over there at the hospital, you know, standing out with her daughter. So my husband and I had to take everybody. So we had to move a little more, do a little more, and change our schedules Yesterday was Monday, and so I actually forgot to weigh myself until later on, and it was later on, so I didn't even weigh myself. I don't know how much I weighed, but with that being said, it probably wasn't a weight, so weight loss day anyway, because um, last week was another one of those weeks which we have life. We live life, so we need to learn to make adjustments for life. We can't go back to our bad habits because things happen in our life. Our bad habits need to be diminished and we need to live things, you know, make it our normal to do healthy things. Um, but anyway, uh, yeah, I just want to come in and give you all that update. And so Lord willing, I, I don't know when I weigh myself, but I'm still, my mindset is still on health, eating healthier. I just had like, we had actually my granddaughter, her birthday was Thursday. Um, she was and last week, she was off and on, not feeling well. Went to the, she actually, well, probably a little bit before last week. Anyway, she went to the emergency room twice. They sent her home. She went Saturday, and she was admitted. My niece, uh, one of my nieces, she turned 14 on yesterday. Her birthday was yesterday. So I had two birthdays, a Thursday birthday, a Monday birthday, and a hospitalization. And we had a whole bunch of stuff going on. So we tried to do stuff for the kids for their birthday. So I still try to do things. We did some stuff over here for my niece but with that being said we still got we have, they go to school we still got school homework you know baths food cooking <laughs> and life so anyways yeah that's what i had going on this past week um my granddaughter is better for anyone who is concerned and if any if you already knew that she was in the hospital and you were praying for her thank you so much for praying for her uh she was uh really well she's much better thank god you know but uh i'm not gonna stay long y'all know once i start rambling i can ramble i am a rambler however let me see i want to say something hmm. I forgot. of course i'm always i'm a busy woman <laughs> i've been a busy woman for a long time um here uh you know I wash clothes for everybody now and we cook i gotta go put i'm putting something in the crock pot today i'm getting ready to wash some more clothes and just live life so i thank you so much for watching me for joining me oh i have a school meeting today too oh i was gonna tell you about my brother yes say a prayer for my brother he's actually at the hospital now well, not the hospital he's at the doctor's office now his kidneys weren't doing well when he went to one doctor so they referred him out to a nephrologist and so he's trying to they're running tests or you know doing what they do and they said hey the first doctor which she didn't know uh a lot i guess i don't know but from her test results she was saying that maybe he would he might have to go on dialysis so we've been praying for him but she's 
if he's watching this and you pray, say a little prayer for him. Uh, we may have the results already um, once you see this video, but still pray for him. Because if he does have to go on dialysis, then of course he would have to be admitted into the hospital, you know, to start that process. And then he has these six little kids. So, but we're hoping for the best, praying for the best on that. That is what I wanted to say. And now I want to say thank you so much for watching me. Join me again next time. And remember to always put God first. Thank you. Bye.